Hey, you all right? Mind if I sit here? Uh, hi, excuse me. Mind if I sit here? What? Uh, I was just thinking about it. It's only been a week since... Since when? Since I met that girl here. Can life really change this much just like that? Mm, it happens. But maybe it's the dreams. If you don't get enough sleep, your brain won't function right, and you start seeing things differently. So you're saying that you think she's an illusion too, right? No, I'm not saying that. Yes, you are. So, to be honest, I... I don't even know what's going on myself. Fuck. A lot happened. You're probably just a bit confused. Plus, you have been drinking a lot lately. Hey, can I get an order? Uh, sure thing! Maybe I am going crazy. Fuck, man. <sighs> okay. That night, it was like this. I had a bad dream the night before, so I was here drinking, trying to forget. They all left early. I stayed here, then... Then she walked in. <sighs> Wait a second. That night, when she walked in the bar... There was something... No, there's a lot of people here. But this isn't really my crowd. I'm sorry, miss. That's right. She spoke to someone else besides me. Oh, yes. May I help you? Play coy with me. I'm talking about Catherine. You saw her, didn't you? I saw her? Um, excuse me, Don't but... Don't fuck with me, old man! I am serious! Hey! Hey, Vincent! Everyone else said that they didn't see her. And don't you think it's crazy that only you did? You're the one that's crazy. Me? See her? Because of her, I'm starting to lose it. I already know that you're the key. Damn it! Why didn't I realize it sooner? Come on, cut it out! <laughs> you saw her! I know you saw her! Speak up! Stop moaning and answer me, goddammit! Vincent! Fuck! <coughs> Just... say something. Please, man. Please. Tell me that you saw her! Well, very well. <coughs> If you must persist. Yes, I did indeed see her. Huh? She was blonde, wearing a provocative white dress, like lingerie. Yeah, 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 that's the girl. And you saw her with me yesterday, right? Yes, of course. It's your preference, isn't it? <laughs> Girls like her. So then, you admit it. All right. See? He did see her. <sighs> Jesus. Really? You are just full of surprises. Not only did you survive this long, but to think you figured me out. Huh? I must commend you for your perception. Uh, well, I didn't really perceive anything. And sorry about the choking. A lot happened, so I was a bit freaked out. <sighs> Tell me you didn't see her. There is no way she does not exist. <laughs> well, normally that is the case. Normal people can't see her after all. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> Wait, what? That's only natural. After all, she isn't from this realm. Boss? It was rather unnatural, wasn't it? <laughs> a girl like her in a town like this? Huh? Either way. You don't need to worry. <laughs> I have given up on showing you nightmares. Showing me nightmares? It was quite a sight watching you run like the wind. Uh, what are you talking about? Huh? She was here, right? Her, 
Catherine. Uh huh? Uh, wait, you didn't rush me because... I just... I just wanted proof that she really existed. I knew that you saw her. You did, right? Ah... Uh, I see. Ah... Uh, hey. <clears throat> the usual, sir. Rum and cola, was it? Hey, boss. Can I ask you something? Uh, what would that be? You see, I thought that nightmares were something that you see on your own. So could it be... that... That... That someone else can show you one? Well, I... I, I wonder... Come on. Uh, well, I, I wonder... I wonder my ass. Pretty sure I just heard you say you're somehow involved in this. Uh, did I? You heard him, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, he did. So what was that all about? Huh? Well, uh, what did I say? You were surprised I survived? What does that mean? I didn't say that. You said it. I didn't say it. Stop fucking with me! I know that you're hiding something! Tell me! I don't know. Why do I have to go through all this shit? Well, it's not just you. Excuse me, I was not expecting this turn of events. Fuck you! Every day is unexpected for me! And what is with these fucking shades? You are indoors! with a desperate man now. Thanks to you and your bullshit, Catherine and I are through. So explain yourself, you <laughs> fucking monster! <sighs> Allow me to introduce myself. I, Thomas Mutton. <laughs> okay, okay. Uh, to sum it up, when there are people like you who spend a long amount of time with a partner without commitment, it impedes the population model. The rate of population growth is less than optimal. What the hell are you talking about? So, I have these hesitant gentlemen climb that. Wait, you're talking about the nightmare? Oh, you're the one behind that? Who... who the hell are you? I have been given many names by humans since ancient times. Wasting a woman's time of greatest fertility is a hindrance to the future of the species. So we separate these non-fruitful couples and redistribute the women to men who can follow the natural order, you see? Okay, so what? You're just killing men who have a partner that they don't want to marry? Is that it? Well, well to put it bluntly... You think I'm gonna accept your bullshit story? Please do not worry. You won't see that young girl ever again. Huh? She is a succubus. She appears at will and seduces men under the curse by appearing as their ideal woman. If you're going to sever ties with a longtime partner, what better way than with a messy affair, right? Oh, man. <sighs> Do you understand everything now? <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get everything. So, in the end, what am I guilty of? Uh... <laughs> if the girl doesn't exist, then it's not cheating. <sighs> if it feels like cheating, then it's cheating, right? You think... <laughs> you think you can just get away with this? Uh, well, it isn't like I just started this job yesterday. After all, the reason you were born was because we weeded out the man who was misleading your mother. <sighs> I do believe that was the case. You better stop fucking with me. If you don't wish to believe, that's fine. However, it is a necessary evil. <sighs> Having a broken heart may be painful, but you have also earned your freedom. 
Plus, you have a fierce will to survive. You should be able to grasp happiness again soon enough. To me, she... she was already family. I only realized that after I was dumped. How pathetic is that? I really can't help you there. This entire situation is your fault, right? So what are you gonna do about it? Huh? What? You're the one who cheated. How is that my fault? Well, it sure as shit isn't mine. You're the cause of it all. Plus, I was ready to get married. You got your wish. Uh, but that was only due to your cheating on her, right? Besides, it's too late to make up with her now. You don't get to decide that. If you really intend to push me, tonight I will have to show you what I can really do. If that happens, then tonight will certainly be your last. Are you prepared to die? Prepare to die, huh? Tell me, what if you die here before I do? Vincent! Hey, wait a second. <laughs> Yo, you still alive? Yeah, we came back since we're worried about you. Let's drink some more, man. Wouldn't be able to sleep anyway. I didn't have any problem sleeping. Uh, hey, something happened? Uh, guys, Boss and Vincent are- It's okay, don't say anything. Uh, but- What's wrong? Uh, sorry, I, uh, I haven't finished my chat with him yet. You guys start the party without me. Whatever you say, just don't go aggro, you drunk. Ah, don't worry, we're just, just playing some games here. <laughs> right? Yes, that's right. <laughs> There's no point screwing around with you. I'll let you off. For now. But in return... About what you were saying? If I am still alive tomorrow, you're gonna grant me my wish. Wait, Vincent. What are you saying? I'm telling you, it's impossible. Then you should have no problem making that promise. If you really can control the nightmares, then make this one the last. It will be the last, whether you win or lose. Not just for me, everyone else. It ends tonight. And not only that, you're going to arrange to have Catherine meet me here. It's impossible. Well, I can't do it. I can't call her, and it's not like I can just text her. <sighs> Very well. If you agree, then I honor your conditions. Really? Great. And remember, you better keep your promise. Got it? Oh, hey, Vincent. Are you sure about this? One week of this bullshit is more than enough. And sorry to make you worry back there, but I gotta end this. Not so much with this jackass, but with myself. What's with him? Acting all badass. So wait, boss, you said... <sighs> Where, boss?